Hello, my name is Johan Falk. I'm a math and physics teacher in Stockholm, Sweden. And this is a short video where I demonstrate something called G regression, uh, a script for Google spreadsheets where you can do regression analysis on data. And this builds on a script from a guy called Tom Alexander, who has done a JavaScript library for doing regression analysis. So thank you very much, Tom Alexander. If you want to try this out, the easiest way to get started is to go to tinyurl.com slash gregression1. Uh, that will uh, bring, well, give you a copy of a spreadsheet with the relevant scripts set up. Looks like this. Da -da -da. And you get some example here as well of X and Y data, but you can have, of course, enter your own data if you want to. You have a new menu here called G regression, and if you try this, it will say we'll have to authorize the script because it would like to read and, and write data to your sheet, of course. So let's accept that. And the way to use this is that you select X and Y values in two columns, must be two columns, X must be first, then Y and you run the analysis, the regression analysis, and you can select here five different types of regression, linear, exponential, logarithmic, power functions, and also polynomial functions. If you select the polynomial function, you get to select what order up to five. Uh, theoretically, theoretically, you could have more. The, the library can handle, I guess, any number of, of polynomial order. But, it, well, very seldom you need more than five, so I restrict that to five. And you get the uh, fitted, well, the equation for the, the best fit here directly. And if we say, if you can't get a nice uh, fit, in this case, we have uh, negative, well, a logarithmic function can't be found here, probably because we have both positive and negative x values. And you get some kind of error message here instead. If you want to, let's see, uh, you can also get a scatter plot from the result here. So if I click here, we'll get a new sheet. And this should actually be closed. So let's fix that later on. And you get a sheet here, well, a, a chart uh, with well, original x values, original y values, and then the uh, y values fitted to this function which is displayed here in the diagram as well. So you get a diagram with this. And you can play it with this of course and, and edit and maybe remove the original data so we only have the fitted one left or something. And yeah, that's it. Uh, eventually when this is approved by Google you will find this script by going into insert script and search for g regression but it's not there yet I've submit, submitted it so in a few weeks it should be there and that's it if you have comments or suggestions please leave a comment and you can also go to github and find this project and, and work on it or leave an issue or, or whatever you like thank you for watching see you in another video